this is Brent, and his ID number at the Baldwin Park Shelter is A5102111. He is a Basenji Shiba Inu mix, uh, about four years old, and came in as a stray on August 18th uh, out of El Monte. He weighs about 24 pounds. A uh, handsome boy, isn't he? He's really, uh, he does well on a leash. Uh, he does pull a bit. He's, he kind of wants to be everywhere at once right oh, yes. now. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, he is definitely housebroken. Um, we are recommending that he probably meet uh, adults first and maybe grown children. We're not sure about little guys yet. He has, he's very, very stressed here. And uh, he's not, he doesn't like to be handled that much, right, Kristen? Right. I we're not sure we think it's the body, because you can see he wants... He wants attention. <laughs> he wants to be in your lap. He wants attention. He wants to say hi. All that stuff. But sometimes when you touch him in certain parts of his body, he'll he'll get upset. So yeah. he may have... Who knows? He may have... I notice he's got a lump on his... Uh, that may just be his rib sticking through. You know, but he's... Some, there's something going on with him that, that requires a little bit of extra patience. You right. know, just... Yeah. So uh, he just feels it'd be safer with adults. Yeah. So he can understand that. Yeah. Yeah. I, 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 I'm not sure about little bitty kids, but he's, um, you know, he's a dear... But he's a darling, and he's, he's going to be actually very active for an, yes, an active... Yes, great uh, activity for him. Yeah. Yeah. He's, he's going to like... He wants to go now. <laughs> he said, speaking of which, can we go do something please yeah Sorry, see he, he, he does he comes right back to you every time he oh, really he wants and the attention he gave me some kisses yeah and, yeah so he probably has some kind of who knows he doesn't like to be touched or he's got something going on somewhere on his body so he's yeah. afraid you're going to touch it you just you don't know Good, well, but he's all times he showed to me it was when he was actually being touched being touched yeah so there's something there but we don't know what right. but you know, it just takes a little bit of extra attention. That's all. And but he's a he's a sweet guy, and um, he, like I say, I think he's going to be. If you want an active dog, you know, you want a running partner, a walking partner, he's going to be a good candidate because he's he clearly got a lot of energy. I think he's going to be really good at that, and he's a real good size. He's not a big dog. You know, he's he's actually a he's kind of a little dog, but with a big dog personality. Exactly. Huh? You know, he's you kind of fit well. You kind of fit that in between. Yeah. Somebody wants a big companion dog, but doesn't want an 84. Pounder. There you because are. he also wants to be a lap dog. So yeah, he's definitely a lap dog. Look at him. Look at him. He's just hugging you like crazy. So oh, yeah. he's very, he's a very sweet boy. Just you know, just go slow with him and and uh, until we find out what that sensitivity is. So he. <laughs> He wants to see all the other dogs. That's right. He's very, he's very dog oriented. He is. Yeah. And people oriented. He's, he's, oh, yeah. He's, he went up to every person. Too. He's constantly coming back to you. Puts his hand so. in your lap. Yeah. Huh. yeah. Yes. Okay. This is Brent. And, uh, you know, he needs a home. We don't know how he got lost or, you know, displaced. But here he is. And uh, he's a sweetheart. So come on down and give him a chance. He's a good boy. Hi, Brent.